So why are we hanging out inside if you've been craving the sunshine? Well, I'm uploading a video right now. I'm starting a new uh, a new movement. It's called the mentally cool movement. I'm just sick of being referred to as mentally ill. You know, I don't. I'm not ill. I'm not sick. I don't have a disorder. You know, I'm mentally cool and I have bipolar maniac hackiness. Frankly, I think I might drop the bipolar and just call myself a maniac hack because it's just a definition. You know, my technical diagnosis that I got in the psych ward was bipolar affective disorder number one with psychotic features. Psychotic features simply meaning I hallucinate when I'm manic or when I'm in certain modes and I have delusions of grandeur such as ranging from thinking I'm Jesus Christ to thinking I'm, you know, building an empire. Uh, but maybe I am, you know, who's to say I'm not? There's an intense discomfort in my chest. Oh, what do we got here? What you doing? I'm just heading back to the house right now. You need a lift? Nah. I'm fucking with you. I'll see you in there. I'm heading over too. <laughs> Dr. Bonnie. Oh, hey. Hey, we're filming Dr. Bonnie. They want to shoot a film today. Oh, nice. Yeah. That's awesome. What's good with y'all? Oh, you know, we're just uh, rambling then, rambling. What does this sound like? The intense ramblings of a bipolar refrain? You can't quit till you get to one more hit? Rather be Brad Pitt than me, but I take the check on kind of guy at Macy's life over mine. Can it be? But I'm clearly insane. Or just as mentally insecure in my own domicile, it's so full of toxic bile. I want to cry teardrops of liquid piss. Let it float on my lips and kiss my own ass with it. Realize this pain can't last forever, ever. I'm so full of fervor that three months ago I couldn't pick myself up, up on a bed. So deep is the dread. I woke every day. Then we saw here. What, you're just going to drive off on me? got to run, man. That's just weak. That's just weak. Some people just don't have the time, you know? That's what I've discovered. I'll swing in first thing tomorrow morning, okay. and we can, uh, with all the material, DVDs and everything, and if it works, it works. If it okay. if it doesn't, I'll rent a projector and play it in the well, middle of the yard. Um, I'm just kidding about I'll have renting a, a projector. I'll tomorrow, too, okay. that I can run stuff over. So. All righty, cool. Okay. All right, Scotty, let's move. <laughs> this is day 110, sobriety. I've been sober for 110 days. I haven't had a drink since last July. I haven't had a puff of the green stuff since... Uh, 
110 days ago. I hadn't had any coke and since the drinking ended. I haven't done mushrooms, opiates, or ecstasy in quite some time. I, I didn't even mean to do ecstasy when I did it. I, it takes ice cream chunks out of your brain, but some of that got tricked, basically. Ice cream chunks. See, my issue right now is that I'm filming three films at once. Johnny Butter's American Narcissism, where I play Johnny Butter. Capturing the Intangible Butterfly, where I play Jack Weatherston. Uh, Capturing the Intangible Butterfly, where I play Nick Hanson and The Desperate Man, where I play Jack Weatherston. I just gotta consolidate, I think. It's just Johnny Butter's American Narcissism. This is my life. Welcome to it.